It's the 10th week of the 2013 season as the 6th ranked Stanford Cardinal hosts the 10th ranked Sonoma State Seawolves. Both teams are undefeated in league play, so this is an important match as the teams prepare for the WCLL playoffs in a few weeks. Drew Verk for Stanford and Doug Carl for Sonoma look more like old friends than opposing coaches as game time approaches. With 9.43 remaining in the first quarter, senior midfielder Ryan Heidrich scores on an inside roll to put Sonoma up 1-0. Two minutes later on a quick whistle restart, Stanford ties it at 1-0. Sonoma goalie Dylan Fannin made several big stops in the first quarter and had a 662 save percentage for the game. Late in the first quarter, Sonoma went man down for three minutes on an illegal stick call, but Stanford failed to capitalize on it. In between quarters, Stanford was called for the same violation, a shooting string too close to the pocket, and Stanford goes man down for three minutes at the start of the second quarter. Sonoma then scored twice and surged to a 3-1 lead before Stanford could run out the penalty. Back to even strength, senior attack Jack Farr hits freshman Romer in the crease to pull Stanford within one goal at 2-3. At the four minute mark, Sonoma's offense comes to life as Heidrich feeds Kyle Riddle who scores on a step down shot from the alley. Then a dodge from behind X forces Stanford defense to slide and Morosky scores. With just seconds remaining, Riddle scores on a second step down shot and Sonoma leads 6-2 at halftime. Stanford comes out strong in the third quarter and at the nine minute mark, Farr hits Romer in the crease and he finishes to cut Sonoma's lead to three goals. Consecutive slashing calls put Stanford two men down, and Brad Bochessa scores from X, puts Sonoma up 7 3. Captain Jack Farr dodges from behind X, hits Romer, who scores on the assist. And then, with time running down in the third, Farr scores a huge goal to pull Stanford back into the game, down just two goals. Sonoma takes the faceoff to start the fourth quarter, and then Morosky scores to put Sonoma up 8-5. Farr dodges from X and feeds Peter Doyle for the score as Stanford cuts the deficit to two goals. Midfielder Heidrich scores on a sweep, and then on the next series, Sonoma's number 11 follows with a huge running rip to put them up 10 to six with 10 minutes remaining. And the Sonoma fans are starting to feel it. Sonoma wins the next face off, but then Stanford lays a big hit on him and they're assessed a two minute non-releasable penalty for illegal body check. Once again, Sonoma's man up offense takes advantage and they score two quick goals, the second by senior captain Kyle Riddle and they lead 12-6 with 8.48 remaining in the game. With 4.27 left, Jack Farr from Stanford scores the last goal on a fast break. His two goals and four assists in the game were not enough as Sonoma rolls 13-7.